Okay guys, welcome back. Uh, this is Small Zay coming from Majorcraft Minecraft and today I'm bringing you guys a remake of how to build a good spawn. Um, this is also in 1.6.2 and I'm making this because of all the old stuff that I, I mean, all the other stuff I did not add in in the other video. Um, so this one's going to cover up most of you guys' complaints and whatnot. So, to begin with, um, you can get plugins for your server. That's all different. Um, that's all depends on you. This is just what I have. Um, I'm soon to get more. But the main one, the main ones I recommend would be World Guard, World Edit, and uh, Essentials. Now with those plugins, uh, World Guard will let you block your spawn, as in it'll it'll guard your spawn. Um, it'll set up some regions for it so people can't build there. Um, now, one of the things I prefer to doing, um, if you guys have multiverse or multiple worlds, make your spawn in a totally different world. If you can, make it a flat world. It's much easier. It makes less lag and everything. Um, now, that, now, for example, the server I have, now this is in a separate world, and it does make much, it, it does make a difference when it's in a flat world. Now, um, as you see, and oh, another advantage to having in a flat world, it uh, whenever you update it, say for example, it goes from 1.5 to 1.6.2, you can keep your spawn the same and just reset your other worlds because those other worlds, those blocks will be changing. Um, so those are just a few tips I recommend where to build your spawn. Um, but anyways, let's get started. Um, like I said, um, I keep mine in a different world. So let me see slash. I keep mine in a different world, so as you guys can see, it's flat out there. Um, and I just have portal. I have a circle room leading portals to uh, like survival world. Got the creative over there, and I have the city, which I'll get to in the members area. Members area is donors. Um, now I keep the city and the members worlds in the same worlds of spawn. I just, just kind of build them away. But then the survival is a different, is a totally different. Uh, is a totally different, um, what do you want to call it? A different, call, different, a totally different uh, world. So is creative. Um, now, for, I'm going to show you guys right now. Well, so, see, when you're making a spawn, you don't want to make it too, too com complicated. So as you see, I have one sign here. Okay? And then, uh, doing all the rules and whatnot, I put that in each individual world. And each individual world has different uh, rules. As you see here, I come in here, and then here are my rules right here. Um, not not much, because people don't have to sign, don't read them, so I don't recommend a lot of rules. Um, you just gotta watch out, have good staff, make sure no one breaks them. Um, and same goes with creative, which I have not made creative yet, because I'm still making this new 1.6.2, and the IP will be in the description for anybody who would like to join the server. Uh, yeah, see, I don't, I don't have anything built in here yet. Okay, um, let's go back over here. Also, something I do recommend for making a spawn, um, you can get a plugin called First Join Plus, and in this, and with that plugin, uh, that'll allow you to people who first join your server for the first time, it'll let them spawn in a different area. So if you want to like have those guys have like more rules, um, if if you if you want like. If if you want the people who first join like like to see something different, um, uh, you can make a different air, you can make a different area and get that plug in and that works just j just good. Now um, I'm gonna show you. As you see, I don't have much of my stuff in here like information and like like where my, like where to donate at. Um, like I have chess shops, so you don't have, there's no there's no uh, there's no area for that in here. So what I did another spot. In the world, I uh, let's see. I I made I made like a little. Oh yeah, of course it's a city, but I mean I made I made an area for all this to go, and I named it the city. And as you see here, these let me there we go. Um, like these four buildings are my shops, kind of like a mall. Oh, let this render really quickly. There we go. Okay. Yeah, so these are my four shops right here. Um, now it'll be going. Uh, the like I, there's as what I did. I I, I allow people to rent out um, 
uh, what do I, what am I looking for? Oh yeah, re let people run out floors, and when, then I use residence, and you can click a sign over there, and, and you can buy that floor. Now, for my donors and stuff, I have created this, this whole entire separate building, and here will go all my stuff. I'm gonna, I haven't quite built it yet, because I'm still working on it. Um, over here is gonna go, or over here is gonna be like a pedestal, just like this one. Um, and then there's gonna be like signs and whatnot to buy and information about it. And I'm, I'm doing the same for, I'm doing the same over here. I'm gonna have, uh, I'm gonna have uh, something for my, my role-playing games, which is like Ultimate Arena, PvP, and whatnot. And <clears throat> there's gonna be building in there, and each floor is gonna tell about that game. So that's gonna be kind of neat. Um, also, I have a jail over here, and um, I, I do plan to put um, a staff building for uh, my uh, my staff members, and then they're only they will only be able to go in there, but they can they can look up commands and whatnot, and, and if they forget how to do something or if they need help. Like, but I mean, you guys can always put your own stuff in here. Um, you can always like you can always put your own buildings. It doesn't have to be this, you know. But this is just a good example of what you can do to make a very good spawn. It's nice and organized, very simple. It's not overwhelming, and it's it's I think it's pretty decent. Um, and also, guys, one thing you guys really complained about last time was having, well, not explaining how to make these portals. Well, when I made that that uh that video, it was ma it was mainly meant just how to make a good spawn. Like, what are some of my good ideas? Not how to make some portals. Now these portals, it's a plugin called Creative Gates. It's what you do. You take, let me one second. You take a diamond block and whatever. I'll, I'll, I'll take blue wool, and you need a clock. Now let me show you guys. Let me show you this real quick. All right. Um, uh, let's see, here we go. Uh, you, you, you have to put down on the bottom. I don't, I think you can put something else there too. I'm not sure you can change the ID and the config. But, once again, this, this plugin is called Creative Gates. Uh, let's see, like that. And you take the clock and you light it. And boom, this makes, wow, I already made, oh, it's because it's wool. But, as you see here, I'm in Creative. One second. Let me go through one more time. There we go. If this wasn't wool, if I made it out of something else, I, I would make... Here, let me let me show it to you guys real quick. Much easier to exp I'll just do this. Okay. Just like that. And now to make a to make a um another portal to go to it, you see nothing it doesn't go anywhere. Uh, you just want to make the same, you just want to make an identical one. Like so. And you light it. And then now, I can go through back and forth. As you see. Very simple. Um, but another thing I do recommend, guys, for your spawn, try and make a theme to it. Uh... You don't have to make a theme too, but you know, don't just make it random buildings and stuff. I, I always like to have mine, I mean, kind of, kind of a little, um, like a little. I can't think today. I mean, I, I just, I just don't have random buildings. As you see, like this is very simple. But as you see, like, like the theme to my city, for example, which I have had this in my other servers too. See, it's kind of modern. I, I like it. It's, it's tall buildings and whatnot. Don't just make it random houses and small. Just, when you're making your spawn, remember just to keep yourself so very simple, or else it's gonna be hard for people to read. And you have a big server and whatnot, but that's a different story. Uh, so I think I covered everything. Um, if you guys have any questions, comments, concerns, please put them in the, down below in the comment section. And please subscribe and like the video. And uh, thanks, guys. I'm out.